Hey you guys, um, I watch Sloan. I'm a huge fan of his work. I think he's really creative. I think he's really intelligent. Um, I think he's very honest. He doesn't make things up. He just covers on what is known as facts or what's being reported. This video breaks my heart. He's so upset. Um, this video is titled, Nick Carter and his wife are threatening me and my family. I'm scared for my life. Now, I'll link Sloan's channel in the description, but Nick was accused of assault again. This isn't the first time. And um, I guess Nick Carter isn't liking the coverage of what's happening. I guess he doesn't like what Sloan has to say. These threats go way too far. And when you see how scared Sloan is, I feel for him. You would think that, you know, Nick being a celebrity, um, you would think he wouldn't act like this and make threats. You would think he'd be more careful. You would think that his name is so used to being in the media. I'm sure he doesn't like everything that's written about him, but his family's been in the spotlight for a long time and there's a lot of stuff happening. And when somebody's accused of something more than once, I don't know. All right, let's go ahead and watch this video. We're just going to watch a clip of it, you guys, not the whole thing, because I do want you to go and check out Sloan's video. Okay, guys, I literally am shaking right now. Like, I filmed another video. I was editing it. I was going to post it. Mm -hmm. But I posted a video this morning about the Nick Carter accusations. Yeah. Um, and now his wife is threatening me and my family, and I'm making this video right now as proof that if something were to happen to my life or my family's life right now, this is who did it. Nick Carter and his wife, Kit, are the people who have harmed me and harmed my family. So if oh, I'm wow. dead tomorrow, that's why. I made this video about Nick, Car Par Nick Carter, and I make, a lot I make a lot of these videos exposing allegations on the, on, in the industry and things like that. I'm actually so shaken up. I feel like I need to breathe. I'm going to show you guys the text messages okay. in a moment that, um, where they are threatening me. But I make videos exposing celebrities all the time. Right. And I don't just make things up. No, you don't. I didn't just make up these allegations against Nick Carter. I pulled it from TMZ, different sources that have said these things. I pulled clips of these people speaking right. about this. Right. I didn't make this up, but you're going to go and threaten my family and our lives. You're seriously going to go and do that. So let's go ahead and look at the text messages. Okay. So she texted my father. I don't know how she got my father's number. Wow. And she wrote, tell your son to remove that video he did today about my husband, or there will be severe repercussions or you will have several. It makes me want to cry because like, this, this is not my family's fault. Like mm. this is not their fault. Why are you threatening my family? Or you will have several uninvited guests paying attention, paying a visit to Bristow, Virginia, <gasps> which is where my family lives because she clearly knows where my family lives and their phone number. So it just, it makes me like, as someone who does this stuff for my job, I cannot fathom going after someone's family yeah. i didn't go and bring you up kit or any of sh like crap about you i just don't understand doing this to this level if okay. you are going to operate in a respectful way and sloan it's not okay and you have every right to be upset over this it's not okay if you truly feel like your husband is innocent then why hasn't your lawyer been talking to my lawyer why hasn't your lawyer taken down all of the articles all of the youtube videos everything online i did not make this up you don't get to go and threaten my family. You don't. And I'm not going to sit here in silence and be scared. So my dad replied with a picture of him holding something to defend himself. I'm going to block it out. Okay. And he wrote, new phone. Who dis? She writes, this isn't Michael Sloan. Let me preface by saying that my father and I have the same name. Okay. So it actually is kind of a blessing sometimes because it gets things confusing. But he wrote back to her new phone who this because he's literally like playing around with Funny, this at this yeah. point like if you really are going to have some people uninvited to my parents home tonight then they're leaving in body bags trust oh, me okay. we have enough to you know no one's no one's gonna kid would I, whoever you're sending to my place tonight they will not be leaving alive if you want if you want to be serious because my dad does not play and i just cannot believe that you have taken it to this level and i will post every single thing on the internet because i have to protect myself right. because what's going to happen now tonight when i'm home alone are you going to come after me too my dad wrote how about you start with you since you reached out first she wrote my name is lauren kit which you guys can go and look her up online yeah he wrote and i should know you somehow 
She writes, that's why I asked if you're Michael Sloan, but you didn't answer the question. You could have just said, she's so rude. No, and I would have known it was the wrong number. It ain't that hard, genius. Rude. Slow AF, I guess is what she meant. Which... Nick Carter, this is how your wife acts? <sighs> what are the severe repercussions? Like, should I, I think actually after this, I'm probably going to call the sheriff's you office. Because I've got her phone number and I've got her name. So I'm going to go ahead and like put in a report that I've been threatened, I guess. You like, my dad wrote, well, if you remember your text, there was a slight threat in your comment. You may have one of my names, right? Is this a child? Your grammar is telling. Which <laughs> my dad's like not over here texting all the time. Like, it's not like he's got the best grammar or whatever. Right. She wrote, you're honestly very stupid, very slow, and you lack basic comprehension. I already know who this is because I'm a private investigator uh -huh. and I already verified who this number belongs to. My dad wrote, okay, Mr. Miss P.I., what can I do for you and your husband? Does the truth hurt? Does the truth hurt? Because now you're threatening my family because of what your husband allegedly did. Mm -hmm. There are people out here publicly making these allegations, crying, and you think that like... I'm the one you need to go after right now. These people are being so vulnerable and sharing what had happened to them. Yeah. If you know what the truth is, tell us all because you guys are denying these allegations. What more is there to it? And what is this type of mafia mentality that you're going to come after me and my family and you're going to threaten our well-being? So who are the secret people that Aaron or that Nick Carter and his wife, Kit, Lauren Kit, are sending to me? <laughs> I just I don't even like I just feel so overwhelmed right now because it is so not fair. It's come nice. after me all you want. Do not go after my family. And if you're going to come after me with like some people you're sending after me, it's not going to end pretty. Like if they have a reasonable case here, if there's something specific in that video that they need to be that needs to be removed or something, their lawyer can go and reach out to my exactly. lawyer. The lawyers will discuss. Bob Saget did it. Drake Bell did it. Uh, who's the girl that plays Jade on Nickelodeon? There's a lot of people. Britney Spears' team. I've got a lot of seasons. This is my life. And guess what? I've got a lawyer. And they work together. And they figure it out. But the problem is, is that I didn't go and make up anything. I also didn't break any stories right. i can provide you a link to every single receipt that is in there let me check if there's any more messages there's nothing more on there but um i'm going to post these on twitter okay. and continue a thread if there's any more and i'll be back and if i'm not here tomorrow and my family is harmed in any way i want you guys to know that it was nick carter and his wife thank you guys oh my gosh my heart breaks for sloan you guys i didn't intend on watching the full video but it needs to be shared it needs to be shared in case anything happens, people know. Um, please go and leave support for Sloan if you feel led to. Um, send positive vibes, well wishes, prayers of protection, anything that you believe in, please send it Sloan's way for Sloan and his family. Again, I'll link the video in the description. I hope you guys are having a great day, great evening, wherever you are. Let's shake off any bad vibes or negativity. Shake, 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 and I will see you so soon. Bye.